All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video. So today, we are gonna be summoning for the brand new Int LR Goku and Piccolo that just dropped on the global side of the game. As you can see, we have all of the animations that we wanna see in our summons today represented on the wheel, Beerus and Whis, Vegito Blue, Super Vegito, my Riding Trunks, Herculon Boo, as well as the Goku Black Rift. Now, before we get into it, I do want to give a quick shout out to the sponsor of today's video, Madara Accounts. They are an online store for stacked global and JP Dokkan accounts with thousands of stones and lots of top tier units for very reasonable prices. So if that sounds like something that you would be interested in, feel free to head down to my description and check out their website. And if you see something you like, you can use my discount code TIGER for 20% off your entire purchase. That's modern accounts. Go check them out. And uh, with that said, let's give this wheel a couple of spins just for good luck. And let's pop over to the banner. Now, I believe this banner is identical to the one that JP got, which means that it's very, very bad. Yeah, I think it's identical to the JP banner. Which is unfortunate. I mean, even if they made some adjustments, it really wouldn't have made it that much better. Um, as I said in my Pass or Pull video from yesterday, this is one of those banners where, unless you really, really want the Goku and Piccolo, you should just straight up skip it. Okay, like I'm gonna do this one video. I'm probably gonna spend, I don't know, 300, 350 stones and then I'm done too. You know, it's like a one video kind of deal because this banner is just really, really bad value for basically everybody. Unless you're a huge whale, which means that you have a lot of money, a lot of stones to spend and waste, uh, the average player should stay away. Okay, so you've been warned. If you want to summon, go for it, but it's not a great idea. On the bright side though, even though there's no discounts, they are giving out 10 free tickets. So everybody, if you log in every day, should be getting a free multi on this banner. So I would recommend for anybody that actually wants this unit to wait for the 10 tickets to be given out, do your free multi and see what happens. If you don't get them in that one free multi, then maybe do like one stone multi or something like that. But once again, it's just a really, really bad banner. But with that said, we are gonna summon now. We're gonna spend stones on this awful banner and uh, see what happens. Okay, so we do have Vegeta coming in. I'm gonna pull down. We go Super Saiyan. There is a chance for a fusion, of course. And since it is the first multi of the video, let's make it a group summon. So get your games out, get your phones out, whatever you use to play Dokkan. And let's, let's go together in three, two, one. Let it rip. Okay, so no fusion on the first multi. Not a surprise. We're most likely not gonna get anything useful in this video, I'm prepared for that. But uh, you never know, you never know. All right, here we go, here we go. Ill-advised summons on the way. Um, not looking so good so far. Can we get a SSR, is that the guaranteed? Oh, it's not, okay, so double SSR multi. Man, I remember the days when like getting multiple SSRs in a multi-summon was actually like a big deal. You know, like back before, I mean this is a very long time ago, back before like there were guaranteed SSRs for every multi. If you guys have been playing for like the last two or three years, I'm pretty sure you've lived in the world where there's always been a guaranteed SSR for every multi you do. But that wasn't always the case as my more long-term players can attest to, right? There was a point where you could literally do like five, six multis in a row and get all SRs and Rs. Like that was, that was a rough time to be a Dokkan player for sure. So now we get the guaranteed SSR, but of course, when you've been playing for as long as I have and you've been summoning as much as I have, it's still like not a big deal if you get guaranteed SSRs because 99% of the SSRs that I get in the guaranteed slot are literally just 
super attack fodder or Baba points. <laughs> like this guy right here. <laughs> oh, that hurts, man. <laughs> that really hurts. I mean, imagine the hype if I didn't have this guy, right? If, if I was like free to play or whatever and I didn't have the UI Goku or he wasn't rainbowed, that would have been such an amazing pull. But unfortunately, he's not usable anymore. But I'm holding out the hope. I'm holding out the hope that they introduce like some kind of a secondary hidden potential system. I don't think it's something that a lot of people want actually, because that sounds like it's gonna make the game more pay to win. But I guess since it's a single player game, it doesn't really matter, right? Yeah, I don't think it's a huge deal either way. But anyways, um, there is a part of me that that thinks maybe at some wow, Super Saiyan one, uh, at some point that they'll introduce a, another addition to the hidden potential system where we can use, you know, dupes on top of like rainbowed units to give them maybe just like a minor stat boost, maybe like 100 to all stats or something like that to a certain point, right? Like maybe you get like a plus one, plus two, plus three on top of your rainbowed unit and uh, it just makes these like extra dupes useful because like for for example my Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta like LR Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta is rainbowed and I have 10 extra dupes on top of that <laughs> so if I can actually use those dupes for something outside of Baba points I would be uh, pretty pretty happy about that you know but um, you know for the time being I, just, I still keep all the dupes of my rainbowed LRs just in case something like that is is on the way but uh i do recognize like i said you know it could be a feature that makes the game less enjoyable or for the play players it sounds like a very whale uh friendly feature right so i don't know if like most of the community would like that let me know in the comments down below how you guys feel about that idea is it is it crazy is it stupid or do you think it's actually a good way to allow people to use extra dupes, right? Like, at the end of the day, unless we get... Ooh, okay. Combo. First combo, actually, of the video. Um, at the end of the day, as long as the game does not introduce a PvP feature, I don't think stuff like that matters too much, right? Because it's single player. I mean, you could argue, like, we have World Tournament, but even with World Tournament, it's not really like PvP, right? It's like player versus computer of like a team that someone else built, but it's not really PvP, so... Um, and also there's only certain units that actually work for World Tournament, so... Yeah, I, I'd be okay with that, but once again, you know, I have a different perspective, right? I have a, I have a more of a... I don't want to say whale perspective, but definitely very much a not free to play perspective so if you guys are free to play or you only spend sparingly on the game then uh, definitely let me know what you think about this like hidden potential part two idea all right now we've been talking a lot and uh, i haven't been paying too much attention to the summons but i i have recognized that it, that they're not going so well <laughs> we pulled one lr so far which is you know, usually a pretty good sign, but we haven't pulled a single useful unit, um, which kind of sucks. I mean, there are a couple of uh, LRs actually that I could get from this banner that I just don't have yet. Um, like the 17, the Super 17 I could use. Uh, I don't have the... Well, there's one more at least. Oh, the, the Tapion and Minosha I could use as well. That'd be nice. Okay. I got just Krillin. Goku and Krillin. Maybe we get a Zeno here. Maybe we get the Goku and Piccolo. Maybe we call it a day. That'd be great. Here we go. Pulling down. Okay. No Zeno. But why don't we make this a group summon? Because I feel like this might be the last multi of the video. Um, I really don't want to spend any more than I've spent so far, and chasing units on legendary summon banners is just a terrible idea. So I think this is going to be the last one, guys. If you want to jump in for a final group summon before we get out of here, if you missed the first summon or you want to keep summoning, which I don't recommend, but if you want to, then let's go in three, two, one.
Let it rip. Come on. Okay, Super Saiyan 2. And Tech Kaioken Goku. Okay. So that most likely is um, what the combo was for. But we still got quite a few units in this multi, so not over yet. I think we're getting one more. Yes, we are. Okay. That's going to be a Kuliza. Kuliza. Great. Okay, well, um, 350 stones is kind of like a good stopping point. But I don't really want to stop. <laughs> Why am I like this, man? Okay, one more. Let's do one more. This is going to be the final, final, final multi. I have committed to that. This is going to be it. Okay, we're not doing any more after this. I just, oh my god. I just have to give myself a fair shot, you know? I have to give myself at least a chance to get this unit, which, you know, honestly, like I want, but I don't, I don't want that bad. <laughs> I, I, I can live without them. I can live without them. It's, it's really this, like, sickness that I have, you know? It's the, it's the collector mentality, I guess, the collector syndrome, where, like, even if it's something that you don't really want that bad, you just gotta have it. You just gotta like try to complete the collection, you know what I mean? Okay, come on. Oh, fusion. Oh, okay, here we go. This is it. This is the one. This is the one, okay. Even if it's not the one, I'm done. <laughs> Even if it's not the one that it, it's the last multi, it's the last multi of the video. I can't, I can't keep doing this. Come on! Yes! <laughs> oh man, I didn't actually think that was gonna happen. <laughs> okay, 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 cool. Cool. Man, um, sometimes, you know, you do stupid stuff like this and uh, it works out. Sometimes you're, you're really dumb and you get rewarded for it. So that, that this is a prime example <laughs> of going just one multi past what we said we were gonna do, right? I said I was gonna stop at the last one. And then, uh, and then, and I just, I just kept going. You know, it just, my fingers just like move by themselves. But uh, it worked out. So uh, this time, it was okay to be dumb. But for the most part, don't be like me, guys. Okay, don't, don't, don't do this to yourself, because, because most likely it's not gonna work out. I, I, I know watching this is gonna tempt some people to go back in, and I'm, I'm really sorry about that. Okay, if you're one of those people, and I made you waste more stones. Um, I feel bad about it. I feel bad about it. But right now, I feel very good about this. So I'm gonna uh, just, <laughs> I'm gonna enjoy it while it lasts. I'm, I'm gonna enjoy this while it lasts. Now, one thing I do wanna quickly check out is um, if they added any new LRs to the coin shop here. Because if they added one of the guys I'm missing, <sighs> ooh, Super 17. They added Super 17. Man, I, I want to buy my first copy. I have enough to buy three LRs, so I think I can swing it. I think I think we can swing it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah, I, I don't need anybody else. I don't know why I'm checking. But Super 17, not the greatest. Oh, hold on. No, not two. Just one. Just one. Not the greatest LR, but he's, he's pretty fun. I like his animations, so yeah. All right, here we go. Boom. Got it, right? Got him. So now we have two new LRs to mess around with. Super 17. And also, more importantly, the Goku and Piccolo. So uh, I'm going to have some fun making some videos with these guys. Should be a pretty good time. Um, 
look forward to those and that's it guys that's gonna be the video as always if you liked today's video make sure to like the damn video if it's your first time watching me first time to the channel then make sure to hit that big red subscribe button join the tiger squad now hit that notification bell too so that youtube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content and that's it i'm out of here until next time have an awesome awesome day i'm tiger with tiger uppercut media Signing out.